Hey guys, Jason here with Quantum Courses, and in this tutorial, we'll be going over how to create product templates on the popular dropshipping platform, Printful. But before we get started, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit the notifications bell so you'll get notified each time I release a new tutorial. Printful is one of the best platforms that you can use to build your own dropshipping store for print-on-demand products. With Printful, you can easily customize dozens of high-quality products ranging from apparel items such as t-shirts, hats, and hoodies to accessories such as jewelry, water bottles, and pillowcases. Once you create product templates, you can easily integrate Printful with Etsy, Shopify, eBay, or any other marketplace to upload and sell your products. When a customer makes a purchase from your shop, the order is automatically sent to Printful to take care of the production and shipping. Using Printful product templates is a great way to build your print-on-demand empire on multiple sites without having to create the same products on each platform. So let's go through the process of creating product templates on Printful. Printful is free to join, so go ahead and click the link in the video description to sign up and follow along. So once you've logged into Printful, let's look up at the top right of the page and click on your account drop-down menu. From here, go ahead and click on Go to Dashboard. Here's where you can view your account data, update your stores, edit your settings, and of course, create product templates. If you look at the menu on the left hand side, you should see a tab that says product templates. Go ahead and click that now. This should open up a page where you can view all the product templates that you've previously created on Printful. Once you've integrated Printful with Etsy, Shopify, eBay, or any of the other marketplaces, you can use Printful to add the products to any of your stores. So let's go through the process to create a new product template. From the product templates page here, let's look up at the top right and click on the red create new button. This should open up a window showing you all the products that are available on Printful. One amazing thing about Printful is the product variety that they offer. With Printful, you can add a range of products to your store, including men's clothing, women's clothing, children's clothing, hats, accessories, home and living, and collectibles. If you click on one of the categories, you can see that each category has tons of different products and each product may have several different variations. So as an example, let's click on t-shirts under men's clothing and see what comes up. This should display all the men's t-shirt styles that are available for you to customize on Printful. The options that are available on Printful are really amazing. As you can see, just for men's t-shirts, there are over a dozen different styles that you can choose from. The various t-shirt styles may be made of different materials, have different color options, and different starting prices. Whether you're looking for a high quality polyester blend or a standard 100% cotton shirt, Printful has you covered. So as an example, let's select this men's heavyweight tee. Once you select your product, you should be taken to the Printful template editor. Here's where you can customize and create the products you want to add to your store. On Printful, you have many more customization options than most other platforms. So first, let's click the print area on my product here to upload my design. This will take you to your file library where you can also see the other designs that you previously uploaded. To add a new design, let's click the red upload button at the top right here. You can then find and open the design you want to add to your product. Once your design finishes uploading, it should appear up top in the recently used files section. To add it to your product, hover your mouse over the image and click the select button. Your design should then be added to your product template. Go ahead and resize and rearrange your image on your template if needed. There we go. Printful not only allows you to upload your design, but also allows you to do other customization options as well. If you click the add text tab on the menu here, you can type in whatever you like, and it will be added to the design on your product template. When adding text, or your design for that matter, you have to make sure that you stay within the print area. You should see a square or a rectangle outline that defines the print area when editing your design. Anything outside the print area will not be printed on the product. So now that I've resized my text to fit within the print area, let's check out some of the other options. When you select your text element, you should see the text editing menu pop up up top here. Here's where you can change the color of your text, select a new font, edit your text size and your letter spacing, transform your text by adding an arc or rotation, and even add a colored outline or a shadow. 
Now that we've gone over various text editing options, let's go back to view all design layers. On Printful, not only can you add new text directly to the template, but if you click the Add Clip Art tab, you can also access tons of different images that you can add to your design as well. Simply type in what you're looking for, and you can access thousands of images that you can use for your design. Once you find one you like, go ahead and click it to add it to your product template. You can then move your image to a new location and resize it if needed. But for this example, let's get rid of the heart. So that's how to create a design by uploading your own image, adding new text, or adding clip art. I think that's good enough for an example design, so let's head over to the product tab. Here's where you can select the product colors you want to offer. When selecting your product colors, make sure they match your design. If your design contains a lot of white elements or white text, you may not want to use a white shirt for instance. If your design works with all colors, there's also a select all colors option here too. One great thing about Printful is that unlike most sites, they allow you to add designs to multiple sections of the product. On t-shirts for instance, not only can you add your design to the front of the shirt, but also add a design to the back, the outside label, which is the top center of the back of the shirt, the inside label, which is really cool for creating your own branded products, and also the left and right sleeve. When you add your design to an additional part of the product, it will increase the base cost. For example, it costs $2.49 more to add my design to the inside label. I think I'll just stick with this for now, so let's head back to the front of the shirt. If you wanted to edit or see what your design looks like on different colors, you can scroll down and view mockups of all the colors that you selected for your product. Also, if you look at the bottom right hand side of the page, you can see the estimated product cost, excluding the taxes and other charges. The reason it's showing a price range is because different product sizes may have different costs. So now that I've finished editing my design and selecting my product options, let's look at the bottom and click on the continue button. Here's where you can create a title for the product template you just made. For my template titles, I typically leave in the product description and add in my design name. This makes it easier to search when browsing your templates and can be changed on the platforms you add your products to. At the bottom here, you can also select the sizes you want to offer for your product. You can either select individual sizes or click here to select all sizes. Once you're finished, go ahead and click on save product template at the bottom. And voila, you've just created a new product template that you can add to your online stores. With Printful, you can set up stores and add your products to platforms like Shopify, Etsy, Wix, eBay, Amazon, and tons of others. Once you integrate Printful with the platform, simply go to the product template and click the add to store button. You should see a window pop up showing you all the stores you currently have connected to Printful. For my example design, let's add it to my demo Etsy store. This will open up another window where you can select the colors and the sizes you want to add to this particular store. Some product variants may be discontinued and will have to be removed before continuing. Once you've removed all the discontinued variants, go ahead and click on proceed to mockups. Here's where you can select the mockup styles that you want to display in your store. Each product that you create will have several different mockup styles that you can choose from. Some mockups may have the product alone, and some may feature models as well. So for my store, I think I'll just go with the men's mockup style here. Once you select your mockup style, go ahead and click on proceed to details. Here's where you can add even more details to your product before pushing it to your store. This includes updating your product title, adding more to your description, and even adding size guides. If you select to add a size guide, you can also select to add an imperial chart or a metric chart or both. If you look underneath your charts, you can also add tags to your product listing. Tags are keywords that can help your product get found in search. Go ahead and add up to 13 and make sure you separate them with commas. And finally, you can select the style you want your product to be displayed as. This can include unisex, male, or women. For my product, I'm going to leave it on unisex. Once you're finished filling out all of your product details, go ahead and click on proceed to pricing. Here's where you can adjust the pricing for your product sizes or variations. So in the first column here, I can see all of my product sizes. 
The next column shows the Printful price, which is the price it costs Printful to produce the product. The third column shows the revenue you receive based on the retail price that you set in the fourth column. If you click the drop down menu under retail price, you can set the price for all your product variations. You can also use the plus and minus sign here to change the price for each individual variation. When you update the retail price, you'll notice the amount in the revenue column update as well. Once you're finished setting all of your prices, go ahead and look down at the bottom and click on submit to store. And there we have it. My new product template from Printful has been added to my online store. Depending on the store that you're uploading to, there may be a couple of more steps that you have to complete on their website. But once you're finished, your new product should be available for purchase in your online store. When a customer makes a purchase, the order will be sent to Printful for production and shipping. So that's a quick overview of how to create product templates on Printful and how to publish them to your online store. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.